This is a great question that I'd like to address. In the comment, it basically says, doesn't Florida have a look back period for Medicaid? 30 days for approval seems absurdly short. And I appreciate the question, which is why I'm giving you some time to answer it. Florida has the same five year look back period as every state in the country under the federal Medicaid rules. However, Florida being Florida, good or bad, it allows its seniors to legally and legitimately implement strategies that are not subject to the five year look back period. So we can do contracts with family members. We can move all the money to a healthier spouse if you have one. We can invest in income producing property um, and not have the, uh, the amount of the property, the asset, counted as uh, an asset for Medicaid purposes. So there's lots of things that we can do here in Florida that avoid the five-year look-back period. It still exists. And in other states, the five-year look-back period has teeth. I always point out New York, I love them, but they're really difficult for Medicaid in that if you don't plan five years before you slip on the banana peel, you're probably screwed to a large extent on having the ability to shelter assets on the fly and still get New York Medicaid. In Florida, we can have millions of dollars, as I've talked about in the past, and not pre-plan for the five-year look-back period. I wish everybody did. It makes my life easier. It costs the client less money if you plan ahead. But let's be honest, people are procrastinators. They hate lawyers, usually for a good reason, and they uh, don't want to spend money on something that they're not guaranteed to get their money's worth in five years from now. So um, the short answer is Medicaid in Florida does have a five-year look-back period, but our rules are so uh, kind to our seniors that we can always use strategies that are not subject to the five-year look-back period, and that is how we do it. So great question, and I hope this answer helps. Have a great day.